All right, what is up, guys? This is uh, Trigger2295 here yet again uh, for the second time, for the second uh, tutorial in one night. Uh, this one's going to be a really quick one. I just remember that I got a comment today. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how to retrieve windows that are stuck under your toolbar. And the taskbar, toolbar, whatever you want to call it, this is technically a toolbar because these are all your tools. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, somebody commented on my, one of my videos today, and they said that they were using addictive drums, and they were in Cubase, and they pulled the window down, and then they went behind the toolbar, and they were like, oh no! Well, yeah, uh, I'll show you guys how you retrieve those windows that go into uh, hiding. So, uh, real quick, I'm just going to take something small. This should work uh, just fine. Okay, so say this is addictive drums, and I'm just like, oh, I need to pull this down here. Okay. Uh, here, I'm going to make it extra hard. Oh, no. Whatever shall I do? It's stuck behind here, and I don't know how to get it out. Well, uh, even if you minimize it and open it up and open it up. And see, I mean, this, I could just close out, and it'll just pop right back up here. But uh, in a di in a Cubase, he was trying to click the, like, uh, the uh, edit instrument. And he would close it out and open it back up, and it would still be under here. He'd be like, what's up with that? So I'm going to show you guys how to uh, make this uh, get easier to access. So just go to the start menu here. Uh, oops, sorry about that. My hand hit the mic. And then just hit hide toolbar. Or type it in and not hit it. All right. And then right here, auto hide the taskbar. So I guess this is the taskbar, if you want to call it that. Click that. And then right here, taskbar location on screen. Go from the bottom. And you could put it on the left, right, top. I'll just put it on the lower right real quick, and then just hit OK. Oh, look at that. Yay, it popped up again. So now, once you're done, click the Start menu again, and then hit Hide. And type in Hide Toolbar. Okay. And then there it is, Auto Hide the tool Taskbar, Toolbar, Taskbar, whatever. And then just put it back to the bottom, or if you like it on the right side, then keep it there. But I'm just going to put mine back to the bottom because I'm used to it there. And there you go. Your window is back to being uh, accessible. So, uh, this is, again, just a little tutorial. Just a side note how to do that. Uh, just to help you guys in further uh, projects you guys have in Cubase. Because I've done that numerous times, and it gets really annoying. When you can't work on your project, and your window is literally right here. It's just blocked by some pixels. So... Uh, I hope this helped. Uh, if it did, feel free to comment, rate, and subscribe. Uh, like, favorite, and all that fun stuff. And uh, mostly, though, subscribe. Uh, that's it. I am Trigger2295, and I will see you in future videos, tutorials, my own material. Actually, I'm making a zombie song. I know, creative, right? Well, yeah, I'm making a zombie song now, so that should be up within the next month or month and a half. So, because I don't get to do vocals a lot, so I'm going to wait until I get a chance to do that, and then I'll put it up. Okay, so that's about it, and I uh, will see you in the next video. All right, later.